Right, so, uh, when we left off, I'm, it's time to go to the beach. It's the beach episode, I guess. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Anyway, look at all these trainers we're not fighting because we, they would literally murder all of my fluffy animals. Oh no. Also, hello, I'm here now. <laughs> Time and space has probably informed people who is here. <laughs> probably. Anyway, we gotta we gotta deliver the goods. Is this a double battle? Probably. Uh, I want to say a lot of battles begin double battles in uh, Emerald. You are not a double battle. You're not even a single battle. You're you're just kids on the beach. Wait, did you already beat some of these guys? Because that sailor should have been a fight. I might have. Yeah, I guess I did. Okay. Okay, yeah, I guess I did. So, time and space has happened. Uh, a lot of stuff has happened uh, since the last time I recorded this particular video game. <laughs> Thankfully, this isn't a Nuzlocke, so if I die horribly, it's okay because time and space. Yeah, I, I spent like a bajillion years in a cave leveling for Brawly, and I didn't re I didn't know what I did and didn't do before then. Cause it's been a minute. It has been actual 60 Earth seconds. Definitely not seconds from a planet that is currently actively exploding. Nope, don't know what you're talking about. I certainly had nothing to do with that explosion. I swear on the people currently definitely not exploding right now. <laughs> on the people who were also definitely were not part of your previous empire? Nope, not at all. Nope, not Fake, at all. I think your I, I think your jacket's like a little on fire there. Um... I don't know what you're talking about. That uh, I, I never owned a jacket. Uh, it, it was that person over there. Yeah, I Drake mean... Lax Lord Frieza doesn't need a jacket. Cool. So yeah, this this hut on the beach as part of the beach episode. Oh, well, at least in Ruby, I kind of lived and died by this particular hut early on. Um, oh yeah, I'm switching you out. It sells beverages, but you have to fight for them. You have to fight some ordinary citizens in order to legally purchase uh, beverages. In, in a video game. That's that's how video games work. You, you beat people up and then they blink in and out of existence and then the number 800 appears over their head and flies off into space and you can use that 800 to buy a soda pop. And then the, uh, and then the other people wake up at home having le uh, learned the error of their ways. Yeah, how dare they be citizens in a beach? How dare this small child in an inner tube have fluffy animals? We, we better, uh... We better teaching some manners. Look at that fluffy animal. I refuse to call Pokemon anything other than fluffy animals. That's that's my canon now. They've got a canon. <laughs> and and yeah, okay, so much as I'm like not necessarily using Lombre, because like I want a Water type, water type. I want to use Tentacruel this playthrough, but Lombre has been putting in some work, so. And, uh, yeah, this is Bullet Seed continuing to put in some actual work. Dang. And this kid is going to give me 800. Well, 48 out of 800. And pay me back later. Anyway, I have defeated all of your minions, evil thing. Give me your soda pop. You have successfully liberated the uh, water cooler? No, okay, it's still making. So here's the thing about this. Um, Gen 3 has these really cheap items 300, and uh, soda pop restores 60 HP. 
Super potions are a little bit more pricey than this. The downside is you have to buy them one at a time, so you mash A for like a million years. I'm not gonna do that. I, I have enough uh, beverage. Yeah, you weren't a trainer in the first place. Okay, so, um... Yeah, this is what I get for taking real life time to do real life important things. A lot of these shops don't exist yet until I find a move or something. Oh god, right, yeah, they're all Carvanas because Emerald. Um, yeah, super potions, which heal less, cost over double, but I can buy them en masse. How many of these do I have? Oh, I have 30, okay. Um, so I've decided not to bother. Also, I looked into it, uh, RE pickup. It's not that Emerald nerfed it, it's that in Ruby, Sapphire, and maybe Colosseum, I forget, Pickup was one pool of items, and then Emerald added level gating to it, but you can also get like a lot of really cool stuff from it. Oh right, the box. I keep forgetting this box is a thing. Um, I've never seen that pattern before. Same. It's a custom pattern that Mint made after I told a joke, and this was the joke that Mint came up with. Um, I don't know how to pronounce it because it's basically hex code or something. There's like a generator where you can make wallpapers. That's really cool. Yeah. Hey, my daughter is sick. Tell a funny joke. Okay. What's the fuck up because of the 3-2-X cube? And then here's a wallpaper for your computer. But you get one ever at a time. That's why I haven't generated more. Um, anyway, Slateport Harbor, yeah, if we go down here, we got some friends. They're- they're politely waiting in line here, so we're just gonna queue up with them. Yeah, they- they seem like a nice bunch. This is the line. Well, there's a line here. There's some- the life in the sea is endless, that's what it says, yep, S sure. What what has what has come from the sea has returned to the sea. The, the being known as Surge was not allowed to be born into this world or something like that. That's I was pretty sure that's what the sign says. Anyway, go away now. How did you become a gym leader then? Wait, what? Oh, Surge? different Surge, right. I was going for a Chrono Cross joke. I know. Uh, I this is the name wasn't. raider guy. This is a place I will not be going. I don't care that this is a casual playthrough. I don't do contests. <laughs> so yeah, to grow a market, you just have to have some people near a town and then a market will just happen. Hey, look, it's Devon Goods. We gotta go find the cat. He's probably in the museum. I actually don't remember. As is tradition, though, when we come to a new town in an RPG, we should go talk to people for info, cash, and prizes. Oh, so the first step isn't to ransack every house that's available? Sometimes talking to people does that. They're like, hi, you're a small child who literally opened my front door unannounced. Have this uh, CD that teaches your fluffy animals how to destroy things more efficiently. Or to raise their stats or something. That, that's like Pokemon ransacking. Right, I already just checked here, like, just now. I didn't talk to you, though. The sea is a living thing. Sure. Uh, Nesta right. wants to go to space because they've seen what's at the bottom of the ocean and they want none of it. <laughs> Pretty much. The moon might be haunted, but we have shotguns for that. There's no shotgun for how haunted the ocean is. I think I've literally just gone in circles. Alright, let's let's find the cat. Oh, hey, look, the line to the museum is done. So, you need money to progress the video game. It doesn't matter that it's, like, basically unfeasible that you would ever run out of money before this point. You would have to, like, 
spend a whole bunch of money at the store here. But yeah, like coming here without 50 poke dollars is like not likely at all. Uh, what fighting move do you know? You know double kick. That's not ideal. Double asterisk kick. Uh, might be funnier if I just lead with my chicken against a bunch of sharks. If they get sharked, then they get sharked. Hi, I have, I'm delivering you some goods. Oh no, it's guys. These fine upstanding gentlemen that we won't allow anyone to harm ever. Okay, you led with Carvana. That's not great for me. I mean, I have a good level advantage. Maybe I outspeed. Okay. Oh no, rough skin. Anyway, kicking a piranha is dangerous because their skin is so rough. I, I guess. Did I not pick up the EXP share? I think I didn't pick up the EXP share. <laughs> I should have. Oh, Zubat, right. So this was not the idea anyway. But I'm gonna go ahead and light this bat on fire. And it's gonna confuse me, being very annoying. Oh, right, no, this is bad because Leech Life is super effective against this. Okay, well, super effective, it's still not a strong move. Super effective with an asterisk. <laughs> well, it's not stab. It did stab, but it's not stab. Yes. Anyway, you're gonna send out another fish, so I'm gonna go ahead and send out a thing that's not a fish. Cool, so we're gonna just launch some bullets. Yeah, I, over leveling for Brawly was definitely a choice I made. I was going for the gym leader, but like I didn't fight the trainers first, which would have saved a lot of time and given me more of an idea. Yeah, that be how it is sometimes. Hey, hey, look! It's the leader of the ordinary gentlemen. They should make a leak. They should make a leak. They seem to really like water, so they could call themselves the Water Coalition. Yes, that that feels that feels good. I think um, we're just gonna stick with Water Coalition for the, you know, blue bandanaed proper gentlemen. They're probably not pirates. Actually, I don't think they actually. Yeah, they're they're definitely not pirates. They're eco terrorists. They're not pirates. There's a difference. I already know. Anyway, we're free to- oh, hey, you stayed behind. This is a move I'm pretty sure is Thief. It's not useful. Anyway, we have officially chased all of the gentlemen out of the museum. All of the Water Coalition members. Hello, it's Sunglasses Jerk again. My shirt's not dirty enough for them for me to have driven them away, sir. Oh god, you're gonna force me to have your phone number, aren't you? Well, good for you, I guess. 